First thing you gotta do is subscribe. I messed it up in the last video. The second thing you gotta do is follow me on Instagram at C E D D Y N A S H. I do follow back because I'm not famous yet. And hey, don't blow up my fucking inbox. Say, hey man, I subscribed. Hey man, I followed you on, on Instagram. Follow me back. Bro, I don't spend all fucking day on no goddamn social media. I'm sorry. I have a fucking life. If I don't get to you in the time you want me to get to you, I don't give a shit. You're going to fucking wait. And if you don't like that, don't follow me. But don't fucking get in my goddamn inbox trying to fucking message me a million and a half times about doing this shit. Bro, calm the fuck down. It ain't that goddamn serious. It's only fucking social media. Let me show you all this real quick because, you know, that kind of segues into impatience. Soldier Boy is only 30 years old. I did my history on that one because I know I fucked up on E-40 and Too Short and everything like that. Whatever. Soldier Boy wants to be celebrated but doesn't know how to do it the right way. Let me give Soldier Boy a bunch of fucking techniques on how to do that shit. Because... You fuck up when you piss people off. Yeah, okay, you had a generation of kids that you inspire that are grown now. That's true. But you weren't the fucking first person with Big in your goddamn name, bro. You forget Big L. Well, you probably don't know. But for those who are young enough, there's a dope-ass motherfucking rapper by the name of Big L. Big Daddy Kane, bro. You know what I'm saying? We got Big Pun. And we got B I G P O P P A. Know what it's for? For the D E A. Yeah, Big Papa, bro. But for the the kids who don't know, and you listening to Wayne and 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 all that and everything, bro, we had the Big Timers. So no, Soldier Boy, because you probably got your name from the Big Timers more than likely. I don't give a fuck what you think you call yourself and everything like that. Yeah, little buddy came at you. You had to protect your goddamn crowd. But the way. That you going about this shit. Don't nobody want to celebrate your ass, bro. Here's what you need to do. You need to come at it this way next time. Man, look. I was the first person to do this. I want to inspire more artists and stuff like that to go ahead and get on. Once your time is over, you need to go ahead and be an A&R. Don't nobody give a shit about what it is. You was the first rapper. Bro, you was the first rapper to spam the shit out of LimeWire. That's how your shit blew up, bro. So when we downloading some tracks for whoever in hell and we getting Soldier Boy cranked that, that's really how you blew up. Then you went ahead and did your video and shit like that and created a new dance. By the way, you ain't the first rapper to create dances and shit to your raps. You need to go look up Heavy D and the boys. Yeah, you need to go look up MC Hammer, bro. That shit is not a new hustle. You may have presented it on a way that was differently because no. If that's the case with a lot of this shit, we could start bringing up rappers and then say you stole from them. I'm not going to do that. Should you be celebrated? Hell yeah, you should be celebrated, bro. But at the same time, you need to be a walking inspiration to these youngins. Don't nobody want to hear about what the fuck you did. Not like that. Not how you trying to shit on people and stuff like that. And yes, I know he was firing shots at the Drakey old dude. But this ain't the only time he did that shit. Y'all remember damn near a year ago with the Drake? Jake, Tiger, Tiger, and the motherfucking Gucci headband that seemed like the nigga been cooking all day with the motherfucker on. And I know, like, cuz you got on that tired ass rag. Yeah, but my rags always get washed and clean, cuz. So, man, come on, soldier boy. Is, is you gonna be soldier man this time? And start trying to lead instead of trying to chastise motherfuckers? And I'm not telling you you wrong for shitting on Lil Drakey or whoever the fuck. And I don't even know if that's what his name is. I don't know who the fuck he is. I never heard of him, but I don't really give a shit. But come on, man. You doing more goddamn damage than you could be good. Hold on, yeah. Hey, bro, all that shit you trying to do, I been did. Yeah, I did this, I did that, and did this and did that. But the way it came off, it came off just like how it went down when you were standing in front of academics and the girl and old dude, I don't even remember what their name is. They show just ended. I didn't watch this shit, but I know because I seen this shit go viral. The same shit you did at the Breakfast Club, it all sound the fucking same. A whole year later. 